What's up, guys? So, I've got something pretty interesting going on right now, and to be honest, I'm kind of nervous and like weirded out and freaked out and kind of like apprehensive for what's about to happen, but I'm just gonna let this clip roll. The clip roll, I'm not even gonna cut it up or edit it, but I feel like I need to voice this before I go in and talk. But I just rolled up to Gold's Gym, uh, sh what should have been a normal win excuse me, Monday evening workout. Today is uh, June, what day is it? June 25th, Monday. Um, a little bit ago, about like four o'clock, I got off the phone with Max Tuning. Uh, we were talking about contract negotiations. That's kind of relevant, but hang up the phone. I'm at work still. I was gone this past weekend, so I haven't been to Gold's for a while. Um, and I see I had like a bunch of misread voicemails. I'm terrible at picking up my phone if it's a number I don't recognize, to be honest. So I uh, clicked through them all. There's a couple like robo callers, fake people, you know, like, hi, oh, you know, you're eligible for this credit card. But then I get one that says from Gold's Gym Venice, which I can actually play for you right now. Hi, Ethan. This is Jeff calling from Gold's Gym in Venice. I just wanted to give you a call and speak to you about an incident that occurred yesterday. If you can give me a call back when you get a chance, I'd appreciate it. Thanks a lot. And so that's that. And I was like, what? Like, okay, maybe they like an incident happened that morning. Um, the, the phone, the voicemail was left June 21st, which is a Thursday. And he was referring to the morning of 620. And I was like, maybe there's something happened that I could have been there. I could have been a witness for. Maybe they just want to gather information. So I give this guy a call back. Um, Jeff, I think his name was. I'm like, hey man, what's going on? Ethan here. I received the call, like saying like there was an incident of golds that you guys you know want to talk to me about. He's like, yeah man. So uh, we've gotten multiple reports that you were screaming loudly at people, cussing at people, talking about drugs, bodybuilding related drugs. Uh, and I was like, I think my words were like, wait, are you kidding me? And he's like, I was like, wait, are you serious? He's like, I'm very serious. I was like, I'm what like me these are against me and he's like yeah and I was like I was like I, I are you sure you have the right person like I, I this is so far from the person I am and what I like my characteristics and whatnot he's like yeah man I mean we just have reports from a handful of trainers and I was like I, I and I, I kind of like stammered I was like I I don't even know what to say like the only trainer that I've really kind of somewhat come close with his name is Big Will um, but other than that, man, like, I don't know what to tell you. Like, I, what was, like, I was so, I was, like, tripping over my words because I was so confused. I was like, what? Like, so, anyways, that phone call happened, and, like, towards the end, he was like, well, you coming in to work out today? I see you haven't been here in a few days. And I was like, yeah, I've been in San Francisco. I was up there for, for work. I came Thursday morning after apparent, the apparent event on Wednesday, and, uh, flew out of town Thursday and this will be my first day back. And he's like, okay, so you'll be here this evening? I was like, yes, I will. And he was like, well, hey, well, I'm leaving at seven. Um, would you, you think you can make it in before then? I was like, absolutely. And so by this time it was like 4.30 PM. So I packed up all my shit from work. Like my heart's been racing this entire time. I'm like going through every single scenario, trying to retrace anything that could have been considered somewhat in line with what he had just mentioned about me. And I can't think of anything, nothing. I think I, I was training chest that day and I was like, I even told him, I was like, dude, when I'm there, I'm in my zone. Like, I'm not talking to anyone. I'll give head nods and say what's up to people. But I, certainly was I not yelling at trainers and certainly was I not talking about steroids. Like, what the, what? So, I've been lightweight tripping. I have no idea if, like, here's the scenarios that went through my head. Wrong person, which is hopefully what it is. Number two, trainers are out to get me for some odd reason and they've connived to make up fabricate some story which I highly doubt but you know when you're running through scenarios in your head or maybe this is all just some bullshit like scheme joke to like get me in there and they're gonna tell me something else like like haha I tricked ya I don't freaking know man I'm I don't know it's like I had to force down my pre-workout meal because you know when you get super anxious and you're just like oh I can't like think about anything else like think about what they could uh, I have no idea. So, honestly, I'm gonna go in there with my cell phone on voice record. I'm gonna record this conversation with this guy, um, just so I can play it for you guys after this, so you can either hear what the heck's happening, because I am so at a loss for what this could be about that it's almost has me nervous. Because like I can't even think back to like, oh yeah, well there was an altercation. There, there was, there was nothing. I have nothing in my memory of this. So that's where I'm at right now. Um, Wish me luck, I guess. As you can tell, I'm a little... 
tripping about this, but I don't know. I'm going to go in there and chat it up and find out where these accusations are coming from, how they even landed on my name. Um, I have no idea. No idea. So we'll figure it out. If I do end up recording, you can hear it right now. If it is necessary, I don't know, but shit, man. I'm about to uh, see what the hell's going on. What's going on? So, last Wednesday, correct. when I walk in at about 8 o'clock, I immediately get grabbed by some trainers. And so they called the police. What? Yeah. So are you okay. saying that it was not you? Say that again? You're, you're, you're saying that I it was I have no idea what you're even talking about. Like, I'm taken aback by this. I'm like freaking out inside because I have no idea what this people would be about. When I come in here, I'm like in the zone, headphones on. I don't talk to anyone. The only trainer I've ever spoken with really is Big Will. But I, I don't even know. I was, I think I was here at 8 p.m. or 8 a.m. So uh, I would like to even know what's been said about me because I, ever since we hung up the phone, I've been retracing my memory for anything that could have been rude. And yeah, I, I'm, I'm also lost. from what I hear, yeah. it's, it's nothing that you would have to dig to remember. Yeah. That's, right? That's, like, it would be no over-the-top crazy. I, I'm more confused, like, how my name got thrown into the mix or if, if someone pointed me out or... If, I don't know. Can you give yeah. me more information? So, like really, well, so one of yeah. one of the trainers mentioned your name and I think they found it on social media somewhere and said, this is the guy. Seriously? What, what, what did they say I was saying? Is there, is there like footage? Because like I'm, I'm at a loss, man. I'm, I'm, I'm being 100% honest. Like I have no idea what's going on. Right. Uh, I don't have footage of it, but I just know that it was over on the rack, right there in the first room. What was that? What was I yelling at for? If that I don't know. I just know there was cursing going on, and no man. Some of our trainers had to go up. No, absolutely not. If, you, if there was like multiple people around, absolutely not. Like I, who who can I talk to about this to, to like? Make sure to know that this is not me. Like, you guys have multiple people in here. I will never speak to anyone about that kind of shit. Like, I don't, like, that's not me. So, you know, Will as far was as one I know, of the guys I'm, that was there. Do you mind if I ask him? Who? Will? Yeah, absolutely. Did Will? Yeah. Because he, I think he talked to me. What's up, buddy? Pretty much. You had a bad day that day. What is it? It was a couple of days ago. What do you mean? I, like, I'm, I'm so at a loss, like, I don't even recall this. Yeah, like I said, you wasn't you. What do you mean? You came in here and first you went off with Tito. Say that again? You went off with Tito. You had your black house on, you had a beanie on. Who's Tito? Uh, one of the trainers. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, regardless, you just got me that day. Wait, wait, I, what? He asked to work in and you told him to fuck off. Wait, no, absolutely not. I'm telling you. Absolutely not. He was here. Sable was here, Derek, the other guy, saw you as well. I'm just telling you what I thought. I would never tell someone to fuck off. I always left. I said you, you wasn't in your right mind. What? What? This is, this is literally news to me, man. I, like, I'm trying to get to the bottom of it. Can you remember which machine we were on? You guys were in the third room. So not... On that hammer. And then Jeff tried to chase you down. After the whole thing, he was trying to talk to you. Wait, I'm so confused by this. I swear to you. Like, I... Like I said, I don't know what you... You may have been out of it. No, I wasn't. And you have a twin walking around. Dude, I promise you, there was no, like, any time that I've, anyone's ever asked to work in with me, I'm like, yeah, sure, like. Well, like I said, it wasn't you this morning. The only thing I can remember was, I think Sable came through and, like, he, he pointed, and he was like, you're on this. I was like, yeah, I'm on it, but, like, yeah. that, 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 if anything, my music's blaring, but I can't hear anything. If you would ask, you want to work in, but I would have absolutely never said, fuck off. Well, that is not in something that I would ever tell someone. You wasn't you. What? It just wasn't you that day. Is that the only thing you're going off with, like hearsay? Because like I not hearsay. I was there watching. I was in the other fucking room. I was right next to you guys. I'm like, what the hell's going on? And then you came in here to do some tricep stuff, and yeah. then you took off. Dude, I no, not at all, man. Like, like I'm so caught off guard by this, but like I don't even know like what, what like. I can use the machines you were using that day. I did use the tricep push down after that, absolutely. And then I did. If you're talking about the. Doing it's the kind of stuff that they use on the chest stuff in it's, the back. It's next to the, the assisted squat press? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I used that one. It was a chest day. Yeah. Regardless of what machines I was using, I'm more 
hung up on this situation that I think was totally misread because I would have never recalled say, telling someone to fuck off if they tried to work in. That wouldn't have been, that's not something I would do. This is what he's at. We need to bring that because I'm telling you what I saw, but I'm not an employee here, but what I saw, you, like I said, you wasn't yourself. That's totally not something I would ever do. Man. Like, yeah, is Tito like here? Huh? Do you know if Tito's here? I don't know if Tito's here or not. I know I'm on a lot of the time, but I'm on the way to late. But, you know, it was, just, it was a weird situation. I'm taken aback by it as well. You know me, I'm like... And that's why I said it wasn't you. I mean, you may have been out of it, I don't know. Break up, something? I don't know. There's no breakup. Like, uh, Antonio, this does not... There's either an extreme miscommunication going on, or it wasn't me. But, I mean, if you apparently saw it was me, like, then, I'm, then I, I have no idea what to say. Because well, I, that, that, I'm telling you, that's, uh, it was a, like I said, it was a weird, funky situation. I, I, well, then I, we must have been a misread of scenarios, because I would I would have never told someone to fuck off if they wanted to work in with me. And well, I think you can attest to that. My personality, that's not who I am. Well, that's why I said it wasn't you. I, I, it wasn't a side of you I had never seen before. Like I said, it just maybe you were just having a fucking bad day. Everybody had bad days. No, it was, but it was Tito had to work in, and then then you got uh, who's Tito? Who? That's just another Latin trainer. Well, I'm trying to. And then Jeff started to talk to you. Who's Jeff? I'm One trying of their to. Trainers. I'm trying. I need to like faces, and then I can maybe. But like, I don't. He tried to talk to you, and you wouldn't talk to him. You wouldn't give him your name. And like, no, this is not me. This is none of this. No, that's not none of this is ringing about. And I'm not just saying that. Like, literally, none of this is ringing about. Talk to you, he tried to talk to you, or you got on the machine. No, uh, this, no. Machine. No, man, this is. Did he tap me or something? Because the only thing I can think of is I didn't hear anyone. Because no, he didn't try to touch you. I mean, he just tried to talk to you. Dude, I have no idea what you guys are talking about. And I'm sincerely not bullshitting you right now. Right. Like I said. Honest to God, I have no fucking idea what this is about. Because I would have, one, never told someone to fuck off they want to work in. If someone wants to work in, hell yeah. Two, I would have never ignored someone trying to speak to me like that, or like trying to speak to me in general to clear the air. Three, like I didn't run out, like my workout was over, I gotta make it to work by 9 a.m. So right, right. Like, I, other than that, like I have no, I'm at a loss for words, I don't know what to say. Okay. So it, it wasn't like this was something that was misconstrued, I mean it was so bad that we called the police. The police yeah. actually came in here walking around. This is definitely not, not me then. No, not at all, like I would, seriously? Seriously. This is not, it was not me, 100% not me, man. There was no way, I would remember this. Yeah, this this is not something that would be No, forgotten. like, that's why when I got the phone to you, I started like, what the hell, like, could this be about? I called back because I was like, oh, maybe there was, like, something that happened that day I was a witness of, but, dude, like, no, like, I would never do something like that, especially, like, my favorite place on earth. I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know. I, like, I feel like there's multiple people in here that vouch for, like, I'm not that kind of person. Well, I, I've never known you to do that, though. That's why I was taken aback. I just thought maybe something else was on your mind, work, whatever. No, man. I'm a happy person. Never, never let shit like that get to me. So, like, however we can clear this up, I'd love to. If we can, like, look back on something or whatever, but I have no, literally no idea what's going on. I would suggest bringing Jay in. Are you, are you coming in in the morning later this week? Yeah, I'll be here every day, but I was just out of town in San Francisco the past few days for work, so this is why I'm in training here tonight. You come back like tomorrow or the next day? I'll be day? here tomorrow morning, the next day, next day. But, like, okay. So tomorrow, come grab me. I get in around 8. All right. Um, we'll, we'll grab Jeff and Tito because those were the, the real interactions. And if they look at you and say, no, that's not the guy, then, you know, nah, yeah, I we, apologize for uh, You're okay. Um, yeah, I can I can do that, but yeah, this has me more worked up than I think it does you guys, to be honest. Like, I don't know. Yeah, I've never seen you that way. So, so what, 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 I'm curious, what aspects did you see like that made you say, like, yeah, that was, that, that was Ethan? The outfit. I know you. I know what you wear. It's the, it's the tank top, beanie. Yeah. They're black. There's only one person who wears that. No, there's people who wear beanies in short, short. No, in short shorts. Shorts like we wear. Because that's what you have on their back. And so when, when when they said their story, they said, I don't know, it was a guy in a beanie? or No, I was there. That's what I'm saying. I was in the third room. He, he, he saw it. He saw I part saw of it. I saw what was going on. That's what I'm telling you. I, was like, Dude, I, I didn't understand what the hell was going on. Why didn't you come grab me? I'm so confused. Like, I, or at least like, I was having a fucking bad day. Like, literally, like, I feel like. Like I said, it looked like you was having a bad day. I was like, oh, shit. No, man. And I'm they were like, well, <laughs> I, said, I have no idea what yeah. the hell was wrong. You, Look me right now and say, look, I was having a bad day. Dude, I'm sweating. God. Stop. Look, let me finish. I'll say, final warning, call it a day. But if it was, if you keep saying it wasn't you, and then everyone that was interacting there says it was you, it's a different story. 
dude, I'm swear to God, like, if I, I, this is not something that I would do. Okay. I would look you in the eyes and tell you that a hundred times too. This is never something that I would do. I'll shake your hand, look you in the eyes a million times. Same to you. But this is not something I would do unless it's an extreme miscommunication. But I wouldn't, I wouldn't disregard someone multiple times. I wouldn't run out of here, especially to the point where police are being called. Honest to God. That's why I texted you immediately after I got the phone. I was like, dude, is there something going on? Because he said some of the trainers, and I was like, Big Will's the only one I really know talk to. Right. So I was going to call you and be like, what's happening right now? But yeah, when I got my new phone, I... That's fine. That's fine. Yeah. But like... All right. So I'll come in tomorrow a little bit earlier. Yeah, sure. You know, come find me. We'll is there, is there there's no footage in here that we can at least look at? Like, I'm, isn't there cameras? There's cameras, but I can't pull them up. What is that? Corporate office. They go straight there. Can we call them? Like, because I'm just as curious as you guys. Like I said, I didn't come home because it looked like you were having a fucking bad day. Just, I've never seen you in an argument before. Yeah. But, like I said, it looked like you just having a bad day. So they asked me, what, is, what do you think? I said, dude, I, I have no idea what's the problem. What's the problem today? I said, maybe just fuck, you know, something just went wrong. Father died, something. No, no man. Something that could have popped up. I would love to see footage of this person, but like, Unless I was like literally completely like not the exact person, but no, that doesn't even make sense. Like, no. Well, look, like I said, you know, Jeff and Tito were the ones that had the interaction. So if, if we ask them tomorrow and they're like, "That's not the guy," then. Dude, I mean, but if you don't think I say that I'm the guy, I'm still confused. It's like, I don't even recall the slightest altercation, like none. Which is what has me all worked well, out. Well, that's what I'm saying. I, I think you may have just been having a fucking bad day. Maybe you got a bunch of wrongs out of bed. No, man. I'm just telling you what I saw, and it was you. I, I don't have to wear glasses. I don't fuck around with any time. I'm just telling you, you just look like you were having a fucking off day. No, man. I, as far as I know, Wednesday was an amazing day. No, man. I, I, I don't know what else to say. I mean, there's nothing else to say right now. Like, I feel like we're kind of going in circles. So, I'm just trying to make sense of the situation. And I don't want this to... I mean, I'm, I'm with you. I'm confused by it as well. You know, I, I didn't see it go on. I didn't... I don't know who it was. None of these trainers are here right now. You want to take a picture and send it to them? Of you? Yeah. I, I'd rather just do a face-to-face. -face. Sure, whatever. I mean, that's what it's going to take, but like... I, mean, I could walk around. I don't Tito's an independent, so I don't know his hours. Yeah. I could walk around. Maybe he is here. And if so, I could, you know, grab him later on tonight. And, come up to you. All right. If it wasn't you, I don't want you to get all worked yeah, well, up. I mean, I'm I mean they're, they're, they're going to tell yeah. me if it was you or not. Like, of they, course they were. Yeah, know. you're right. I know, but I, what has my head freaking is like, if there, if there was something that I did that pissed them off and then I just didn't even realize it. But no. I, there's nothing that would have... It, it wouldn't be like, I mean, there was like screaming back and forth. Oh, then absolutely not me. 100% not me. But that's what I mean, like... It was distinct. Dude, yeah, absolutely. It's not something I mean, that was like misinterpreted the wrong way. No, that's that was not screaming, legitimate. Like screaming. How like, long was the episode? Go outside. No, absolutely not. I can I can leave at that right there. I would never say something like that. One hundred percent. That makes me feel better because that's something I would never say to someone, especially in gold, to trying to like ruin that. I have no idea what you were seeing, but I I'll stand by that for my grave for my entire life. Okay. All right. All right. I'll so come come grab me tomorrow morning. You got it. We'll I'll talk to them. All right. All right, next morning, you heard the conversation from the Gold's Gym, if I put it in there, but uh, I have no idea what to say. They're telling me, at least one person, one trainer is telling me that he saw me there that day, I didn't look like myself, I like was like, and but then that's, it was so strange, that's all like that he could say, there was no actual yes I saw you doing this and this and this cursing screaming fuck off saying come see me outside like no this isn't me but how is this other person trying to tell me that yeah maybe I was have like ah, I wasn't even having a bad day Wednesday was a great day I remember I wore my new training club shirt from UVU I was fired up on it I have no idea Regardless, when these two trainers come in this morning, or if they're already there, and they tell me, like, no, this isn't the guy, I'm gonna look at the other trainer, I'm looking and be like, all right, man, seems like your memory works pretty well. I don't know what to say. I'm at a loss for words, as you can probably tell from the 
that clip. So, we'll figure it out. This whole thing has me bent out of shape. It's fucking annoying, to be honest. But <sighs> Shit happens, right? I didn't sleep an ounce last night. I'm gonna go in there and train. All right, good news. I'm not the freaking guy, duh. So I'm in there working out for about a half hour and a half, like crushing my workout, just pissed off about this whole fucking thing. And I, I'm just chilling in the first room of gold, sitting on a dumbbell waiting to do my next set. And I see Tito like walk up right up to me and he kind of smiles, sticks his hand out. I shouldn't have said his name. Sticks his hand out, he's like, Dude, you're not the guy. I know you, you're jacked. Like, you're not the guy. Like, and I'm like, thank you. Like, holy crap, this is a freaking huge relief. Like, I'm like, and then I say, well then how come so-and-so is like sitting here right next to me yesterday telling me like I was the one, I was the one. He's like, really? Like, and he like yells across the room with that, just that trainer that was saying all that. He was like, dude, like, this isn't the guy. And I like st stare at him and I just like death stare, just kind of like, and I felt a sigh of relief because I knew deep down that this is not me, this is not anything that I would ever do, it's not anything, it's not my personality, it's not who I am. Um, continue my workout, going on to the next leg press machine thing, and I get off, and the other trainer that came up initially and said, hey, you're like, you're not you, it's not you, was with the other trainer that him, both of them had gotten the altercation with this guy, this supposed person. and. Uh, and he's looking at me, he's like, damn, dude, like, no, it's not you, but you got a doppelganger. And I'm like, really? Like, and the trainer that I first spoke to, he's like, dude, it's not him. Look at how big he is. He's way more built, like, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, dude, this is crazy, man. Like, I can't even believe this. So that was my week so far. It's Tuesday. It's 8.30 a.m. I can finally breathe. I didn't sleep a wink last night. <sighs> shitty, shitty, shitty. You have no idea how weird that is to like feel like you're being accused of something that you know you didn't do. All right, new vlogs coming this weekend. Chad's coming to town, or I'm gonna go down there or something. I think. So I'll figure it out. Thank you guys for watching, listening to my drama. Appreciate you all. Subscribe to the channel. We're only getting bigger. 230 pounds right now. Show date, December 8th. I've already picked one, so. All right, peace.